Hello, it's Jason Pan for Cold Banker Dean Harper Realtors. Wow, do I have an amazing house for you today. I've got a family coming from the West Coast. They're looking to sell their place for like $2 million and relocate to Texas. And they want a beautiful home. And let me tell you, this one really fits the build. This is a custom home built by TA French. It is a four bedroom, three bath house with, let me get this right, 4,035 square feet. It is gorgeous. Now, I am not the listing agent, but I can represent any buyer if my guys decide not to buy this house. But we do have the listing agents with us, Miss Shelby Renfield from Keller Williams Luxury. She's gonna go along with the tour today because frankly, she knows a little more about this house than I do. So I want you guys to have all the information about this beautiful listing. It's currently listed at 1.725. Uh, and it's on, let me guess, 2.45 acres. So in the gated community, this part of uh, Vintage Oaks and the views, wait till you see those. All right, let's head on out front and uh, start the tour. All right, we're out front of the house. Um, this is in the Champaign Hills gated community section. As you can see, it's on a cul-de-sac. And I wanna show around what your neighbors could potentially look like. Some beautiful custom homes out here. This is definitely a step up from the rest of Vintage Oaks. Now, Vintage Oaks is no slouch. I absolutely love the area. If you haven't seen my video tour of the amenities, I'm gonna go and put that right up there because I love the fact that the Lazy River's here. Uh, Comal ISD, amazing school districts. My clients that I'm doing this video for, they have a gifted special child as far as like super intelligent. And FY Smith and Valley is the high school this school goes to and they have an outstanding program just for those uh, gifted children. So point out the landscaping. This is super cool. The crushed glass out here, um, just so beautifully done. This does kind of go back this direction. The lot does and then down. Uh, love the rock. I had the husband here with me uh, and his dad for two days. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is the exact rock color that he liked. The rain spouts, metal roof does have a three car garage, but some amazing detail in the landscaping. All right, let's head inside and check out this house. Such a beautiful entryway, I really do like it. And of course, if you haven't hit that like button, please do, it does help my algorithm out a whole lot. But man, check out these beautiful doors. Uh, absolutely gorgeous, heavyweight doors, but just a beautiful home. All right, checking out this entry. I love the detail that they put in here. Just really jumped out of your right when you walk into this house and it does fully furnished well it does not come with a furnishing but i'm glad the house is not empty because it shows so much better there's miss shelby how are you doing today i'm good how are you doing great just kind of showing off this house and i definitely appreciate you kind of showing it off with us Absolutely. but wow look at this amazing entry space just plenty of room here for entertaining tall ceilings with an a-frame got a big old fan up there too but yeah, um, oh, here's the dining room. Enormous dining room. Yes. All right, absolutely beautiful. So can you tell us a little bit about this house that sure. I don't already know about? Sure. So the house is um, over 4,000 square feet. It was built by Troy French, um, one of the top builders in Hill Country, top luxury builders in Hill Country. Um, it's four bedroom, three bath. Um, I can't wait for you to see the upstairs. There is a um, room up there like a bonus room and it kind of looks like a little Irish pub. So she, she's not lying. I checked it out. It is really super cool. So don't cool. click off this video too soon. It's very cool. And um, so we have um, high-end appliances in the kitchen, which we'll show you. And then we will walk around the downstairs, check out the master and then um, head on upstairs. It's also 2.42 uh, acres um, located in Champaign Hills mm -hmm. gated section of Vintage Oaks in New Braunfels. Vintage Oaks is one of the hottest luxury communities in all of all right. Texas. Hill People have been watching me for years. Yeah. <laughs> they know my love for this community. Yes. I absolutely love Vintage Oaks. And um, Champaign Hills is one of the nicest gated sections in um, Vintage Oaks. So having a house pop up like this is great. And this one's on a cul-de-sac, which is amazing. Mm -hmm. um, and of course, there's incredible views, which you will see. All right, let's go check out this kitchen. All right, so here we go. So over here, of course, you have, you have leather granite over here. Um, so it's two islands. You've got this big island here with a um, wolf stovetop and the Thermidor range hood. Kind of interesting how they have it. One, the wolf is definitely one of the highest in appliances yep. you can get, and so is Thermidor. Yep. 
I was, it was like, a, probably a style choice. You gotcha. So six burners plus a griddle feature. Um, excellent cooking range there. I do like the fact that you can still interact with everybody while you're cooking because you're still open everybody. And you have the second island over there because it gives you a place for everybody to kind of mingle around yeah. when you're entertaining. And of course, the all important wine fridge. Oops, there he is. Right? Oh, I got to show <laughs> off the sink. Yes. Um, that the sink's sink usually is, a deal breaker. Yeah, the sink has three faucets, which is amazing. So you can see that this slides back and forth. So it's almost like a whole little system, cooking system. Nice. For you. That is absolutely gorgeous. Plate rack. Um, above there and then this over here is these are two double ovens KitchenAid mm -hmm. and this bottom is a warming drawer so that's where you can keep your things your your buns warm keep your buns <laughs> warm there you go all right what else we got on this so side of the house over here this is a pantry a large pantry with shelves all right see so yeah, I did not miss the pantry on this house no nope. yeah, good size pantry yep you have a little drop zone from when you come in from the garage, which we'll look at a little bit later. Okay, but I think, do you mind throwing off the garage? Yeah, or? we'll okay. do it right now. Cool, you cool. have a laundry room with an enormous sink right there. Nice. Granite countertops. Plenty of cabinets for storing everything you might want to store. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so let's head out to the garage. So this is a, this side is a three car oversized garage. Mm -hmm. And for those folks who worried about if they got their big vehicle, if they can fit in yep. it, that is a and full size truck. Extra space right here so you de definitely plenty of space for everything and you're already gonna have storage racks built yep. in there yeah and i got kayaks and the reason i got kayaks is because <laughs> i have kayaks too and i need to take them out and go uh yeah, hit the water just the <clears throat> or the guadalupe river is an awesome place to go kayaking yes. at uh, although the two birds are starting to come out nowadays you have a golf cart garage and or you can use it as a workshop or storage it has its own independent door right there, and then there's a 220 EV car charger. Very cool, yeah. I've got a lot of clients that have been coming from the West Coast. Yes. They like their and Teslas and they're getting yes. houses and built. that's what they have right here. Mm -hmm. So yep, you got it. So yeah, three, almost three and a half kind of garages there. Yep. So plenty of garage space in this house. Plenty. So we'll head back here. If you wanna make a left, We'll go to the master bedroom. Oh, I'm going to hold the master bedroom for last because oh, okay. it's absolutely gorgeous. Okay. I've learned over the years, save the best for last. All righty, let's go this way. All Come right. Way. Yes. So just for functionality, this is another door to the garage. Very cool. Um, you have under stairs closet, so that's... Your huge. little Harry Potter closet yep. there. And then here is the downstairs, one of the downstairs bathrooms. And the great thing is it has access to the outside. Yeah, that is a beautiful... Copper sink. And I gotta go show off the little cathedral the ceiling, style scene yeah. in the bathroom down here. That's yep. super cool. And then you have a door to the outside so that people come in yep. from the pool. Full shower with a tile, a little black toilet there. I think it's probably locked. Oops. All right, there we go. So yeah, so you have access to the uh, kitchen. Bathroom. And there is a pool down there. We are gonna come back out yep. and I'm gonna show off this pool in a second. I got a big green egg and I'm a huge <laughs> fan of big green egg. I was telling, uh, Shelby here, just how awesome they are. Now she's like, oh, maybe I have to get one of those from my husband because yeah. it does transform your cooking style. So All right, check is, out this office. Yeah, so this is technically a bedroom because it's oh, a okay. huge closet, but he had these amazing built-ins put in. Um, so he uses it as an office and of course it overlooks the pool. This right here is a built-in Murphy Ooh, bed. There we go. Um, queen size Murphy bed built into the wall. So if you're hosting enough people and yep. four bedrooms just don't cut it, yep. you've got a, a fifth bedroom ready to rock and roll. Right, exactly. And then behind here is a big closet. Cool, cool. On a barn door. Yep. All right, let's head up the stairs. I'll let you go first. You're not filming my, my backside. No other <laughs> worries there. And I had to point out when we we're doing our preview is like, I love these solid wood stairs that they have in here. It just really, classes everything up and cool handrails as well all right this is the bar area that she was talking about so much it's like this is awesome check this out this ha room was just built for entertaining yes it was <clears throat> got the a-frame uh rooftops with the beams love the theater seating so yep. you can even go bigger on oh, this absolutely. tv if you wanted to have a whole movie room set up yep. and if you weren't into pool 
not have a pool table here, but put another row of yep. chairs or couches in here. Because yep. they got the platform where this will sit up a little bit higher. And you can have this whole wall for your movie room. You're right. And then the bar. And this bar, this bar top is Live Edge Cedar, which is incredible. <clears throat> now on the phone, you mentioned that they had this custom made. So yeah, so the builder's brother made this for this house. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it is cool. And then back here, of course, you have leather granite again. Um, another copper sink, a wine refrigerator, double-sided, and then an ice machine right here. Mm -hmm. um, the backsplash is made of wine corks. <laughs> okay, that is super cool. That wine corks cool. the whole way around. And then, of course, you have all these built-ins with another television in case you have two games that you need to there watch. There you go. Um, and then a wine rack and plenty of storage. Very neat. Yeah. So yeah, if you're looking for uh, a space just to have call your own and your wife has been working on your nerves a little bit, because <laughs> hey, it or does happen. Husband's working on your nerves. Uh, <laughs> we'll and you, need, out you need to have a little getaway. This is an amazing place to just kind of get away this at. This is a cool balcony. And look at this. Um, Perfect glass of wine space. Something about Champagne Hills, the gated community this is in, in Vintage Oaks. It's points of the community. So you get views like this all the time. At Christmas, I'm sure it's spectacular with all the Christmas lights on everybody's house. Yeah, it is really super cool. Yeah. There's a little preview of the pool down below. And you can see how they can fire pit back there and another this, fire yeah, pit this down one below. This is actually a built-in propane. There you go. And then the one on the other side of the gate is uh, wood burning. And this is on the propane side of the community, but they have a really large propane tank already buried. Yep. I'm assuming back off that way. You can see where the septic is. Got aerobic septic, just like, well, everything else in the Texas Hill Country is yep. going to be on aerobic septic nowadays. You got it. All right, if you want to head back in and go to the next. Sure. We do have a couple more of bedrooms, bedrooms up, here. up here that we want to check out. There's the bathroom. Oh, there's, oh, here's just another bedroom. Yeah. A bedroom and there uh, two bedrooms up here and they're both connected by a Jack and Jill bathroom, but both sides have their own vanity section. Yeah. This would be really cool to have a bedroom with a, a, a kid's bedroom with this as a view. That doesn't suck. That's no. pretty cool. <laughs> Another closet with walk-in attic storage. Yes, and um, you know that I call this the Texas basement. Yep. So you're gonna, I'm not gonna go all the way through there, but if you have some stuff, you can put extra storage into there. And then you don't have to climb a ladder. Exactly. I wanna check out the bathroom here for this. Yeah, go for it. You can walk all the way through. To There's the a other Jack and side. Jill. Love the bowl sink, just beautifully done. And even the details that TA French put on the, the tubs shower here. Ceiling is so oh, I just noticed that. That is so cool. Yeah. And then for this bedroom, you're gonna have your own sink as well. Like I said, you'll see what they share the toilet and the tub shower combo, but each room will have its own sink. You got it. Yep, and then just another really good sized bedroom with a really good closet also. And an amazing view out the back. Yep. Well, I, I give the other one a little bit more amazing view <laughs> than this one, yeah. but let's check out this closet. Still, great. Uh, still a great view. Wow, this is a really good sized closet as well. Ain't that cute little mini chandelier. <laughs> <laughs> and then you have a um, linen closet, good size linen closet with Shelby. Built Very in cool. Yeah. All right, let's head down the stairs. All righty. All right, we just came down these beautiful stairs and uh, we're gonna head on outside to show off more of uh, this beautiful lot. Because remember, it is 2.45 acres. You also have a neat little uh, breakfast nook there too. So, so many places to eat, entertain. Speaking of entertaining, check out this patio. You have tongue and groove ceiling with a fan out here and a great little seating area, super private. Now the sun does set off this way. That's where West is at. And of course that's going to change over the course of the year. Perfect for sunbathing by the pool. You can sunbathe by the pool, but how they have those additional rooms, the sun's not coming straight onto your deck and you have plenty of space to just kind of chill and still relax. Even it, when it's really hot out, we are now 21 April and this is our first day over 90 degrees. So yeah, it's kind of warm out today. All right. We already saw this outdoor kitchen space. 
let's head on down and this is what we showed off from above another great little entertainment area i know i definitely love my fire pit session time but wow this pool space is really cool uh, this is a heated pool with a very propane tank so even if it's um not quite hot enough for the water yet just kick on a little propane and you're good to go but trust me you won't be using that too much because it stays really nice but love having the fact that it has a beautiful hot tub gorgeous pool and lots and lots of privacy out here as well because trust me nobody's gonna see you back there nope. eventually there's a lot available on this side of the area actually there's two lots back there but they pie out so much that for someone to build a house on there you are not going to be in eyesight of them at all and they won't get rid of any of those big trees yeah so yeah, if you were the type that wanted to go swimming without getting your swimsuit wet, hey, you perfectly good could do that. <laughs> um, and then you can go out this gate and you can walk down a little path um, down to a lower area, or the wood burning fire pit or the lower, there's like a little low, lower area there. And yeah, you see, terraced, yeah, uh, terraced naturally or terraced naturally down. terraced down going that. So you've got flat spaces down there to go run around and play and have all the privacy you want but uh set up your parties and put some lights up there and you have a really cool entertainment space we're not going to go all the way down there because i'll make the video take forever and they own all the way down um to the bottom of the hill okay and at the bottom of the hill there is a spring fed pond um that is half theirs nice that yeah. is so you cool you can actually kind of see it peeking through the trees down there hard to uh, see on camera probably but it probably is yeah here yeah but if you're watching this video and you're thinking hey i want to go check this house out feel free to reach out to me like i mentioned before i can represent any buyer and we'll schedule the shelby come out and uh take a look at this house yourself and i gotta mention also i love it when uh, my viewers become clients so don't hesitate to reach out to me i'm gonna have all my contact information in the description box so uh and at the final slide of the uh, videos, as always, I'm going to have my contact information there. So please do not think I'm so busy. I cannot help you out. I'm not that busy right now because interest rates, well, they suck right now this time of year. So, uh, yeah, feel free to reach out to me. I'm happy to help. All right. Ready to go to the master bedroom? I am ready to go to the master bedroom. Right. I was just looking at this cool fireplace kind of tucked yes. off in the corner. Still giving you plenty of space for a TV on the side. Yes. So I'll we'll show the front side of this neat little feature. All right. This is kind of the brain, so the entertainment brain of the house. And so this is the front side and we'll show you the back side later. It's one of the benefits of buying a custom house because they've done little things like that to really make it nice. So you have, of course, it's hung roof ceiling again with all the crown molding, which seems to be a lost art. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a beautifully done trying to get those lights on oh, oh i'm not gonna mess with them too much <laughs> but you're gonna have i love the little bump out here and you're gonna have plenty of views of like the texas hill country and tons of live oaks on this property as well <coughs> so that's absolutely beautiful all right just the little details they have in this room but I'm not we're gonna save the best for last that's gonna be this master bedroom bathroom it is beautiful check out this shower we're coming up into you got plenty of space full walk-in shower with a nice bench you got a shower head there with a wand and this is something i noticed before uh your tile closet behind a glass door so you can get your towels without dripping all over everything and you're not having to like hang them from a hook correct you got a refrigerator right here because why wouldn't you have a refrigerator <laughs> in your bathroom exactly and then you have lar two large vanities in here his and hers once again they took that same uh yep. tongue groove ceiling feature from the master bedroom brought it in here plenty of space in here love the tile work that they've done on the wall to the shower and the bedroom nicely. plenty of space in the water closet area just so many little details all right one of the things i really like about some of these custom homes you have your check yourself before you go out into the public space 
uh, so you can get your three-way mirror. And speaking of different ways, we've got two different way closets. So we're gonna have a his and her closet. Let's check out the his first. So even another mirror here. So I well, guess who's got that mirror there so that he can check himself in this mirror. Got your boot uh, rack there. Plenty of closet space, plenty of storage space in this closet. And then you have the and then you hers. Have this little hidden door in this closet. And if you remember a little bit ago, the front mm. side. Well, now if you need to do any work on this stuff, you just access it from the back and you don't have to pull the whole rack. That is brilliant. Someone yeah. someone thought two steps ahead yeah, when they did exactly, that. Exactly, exactly. All right, this is the other side of the closet. This would be the his. Oh, this would be the his, okay. Because the other one's bigger, bigger so that's yep. the hers. Yep. <laughs> There you go. So yeah, this is the his side. Once again, still with the boot uh, shelf there. Some people call them a shoe rack. Like this is Texas. They're boot racks. And this guy's doing it right because he's got boot racks there. All right. And uh, upstairs for you to store your cowboy hats. And it's, this guy's goes to uh, Worst Fest every year. So he's got his Worst Fest hats here. And if you haven't been to Worst Fest in New Braunfels, it's the first week in November uh, every year. Look that up online with a W, Worst Fest. And Wassel Fest. And Wa Wassel Fest is also super cool. That's right after Thanksgiving. We're a cool town. It is such a cool town. And I absolutely love living here. So many things to do uh, the, between the river, the mini need centers here, which I talked about when we're outside. The downtown area, if you haven't been to downtown New Braunfels or Green, all that is right at your fingertips. Those are the places I take any of my clients that are coming from out of state. I've got to take them, especially to Green, go eat at the grist mill, and people go, oh, holy crap, I'm in love with this part of Texas. And frankly, so am I. That's why I live here. And that's why I promote this area, because I only promote areas that I believe in. And trust me, I believe in this community. Right, that's going to do it for tour of this absolutely gorgeous home built by T.A. French in 2016. Remember, the asking price as of the end of April 2024 is 1.725. Get it right? Cool. All right. This house is just over 4,000 square feet, four bedroom, three bath, and as you can tell, it's absolutely gorgeous. I love this air house. I love this community. And if you're liking this video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to my channel. And if you're considering moving the area and you've already got a real estate agent, please stick with your agent. But if you don't have a real estate agent, I'll be happy to assist you in this. There's no point in going through this process alone. And all my contact information will be in the description box, like I said earlier. So feel free to look at that. Anyways, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and as always, share these videos with your friends and family. All right, take care now. Bye.